fax researchers in this video i'm gonna share with you the easiest way to fax wi-fi problem in windows 10. hello friends today after updating my windows version i face a problem that my wi-fi is not working as you can see just i choose the airplane mode even i cannot turn on this as well then i search about this and i solve my problem after solving i decided to make this video that you may have the same problem as well it may solve your problem too the first way right click on this pc manage open your device manager another way for opening device manager is this that you can use here type device manager and open that after opening click on network adapters in this part click on update drivers and browse my computer for driver software roll back your driver in this part choose another one and select next windows has successfully updated your drivers but unfortunately it is not working and it sort of have the same issue okay now what is the second way that i can solve this problem right click here and open task manager and open services or you can easily type here services and open that after opening services come down and find WLAN or config and open that change it to automatic and ok as you can see now mine is working and it is connected to wi-fi network if you have the same problem still or it is possible in some computers or pc that it doesn't show this driver what you should do what is the next approach is open your browser search for your computer model support mine is Dell that's why I'm searching for Dell support drivers you can search this one on your mobile phone as well and here type the model of your computer minus the latitude and this part search for what do you need I need Wi-Fi driver right for Windows 10 64 bit can download and download this latest version install this driver on your PC and restart your computer this way may work for you But if still you have the same issue, connect your PC with a wire network, open device manager and update driver. Another way for solving this Wi-Fi issue is open your device manager, network adapters and and install this driver after an installation restart your computer it may work for you but if still you have the same issue what is the last way that it will definitely work If you want me to make more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell.